It's Mac the Guru, and today we talking All-American. I gotta go deeper on this live situation. We're in Season 5, in case you're hearing this later. If this your first time here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Check out the other content, and everybody click that like button. I appreciate the support. Now, I wanted to go deeper on the live situation because a lot of people may run across this in their life, and when it happens when you're young, you don't really know the implications that you causing that's going to really hurt you in the future. For instance, Liv has a addiction problem with alcohol, right? And she had to call her village. But what people don't understand and salute to her counselor because she said, hey, you need to take care of this now. And she do. She got to handle this now because she cannot rely on her village and put a lot of extra stress on them consistently because it will cause problems in your relationship and then your village gets smaller as you get older and your village change you have to start relying on different people and it just gets harder because that initial protection that initial village they gonna be gone Really think about what I'm saying. Billy was a part of her village. He's gone now. So he's not anybody that she could turn to anymore. She can't turn to her father anymore. As she get older, she's going to still have this problem if she don't nip it in the butt. It's going to be there. It's going to always be there. But she can really have it under control now so she don't be in this situation in the future consistently. Like if in 10, 15 years, if she have a, another problem like this, okay, cool. She call people, they'll come. But if she consistently call people, because this is what certain people do. This could be your cousin. This could be your aunt where they consistently calling people for help. People get tired of that. All right? Laura's going to get older. That's what's going to happen. Let's say Layla and Jordan stay together. What if they have kids? Now they can't be just tending to their sister, his sister like that. They gonna have to, hey man, my kid is her. I gotta that's the first priority now. Alright? I can't stop everything for you. See, this is what happens as people get older. This is really why you see certain people and they be homeless and not in every situation, but in some situations, people end up homeless because they don't recognize it's a progression in life. When you in high school, you need to be preparing yourself for when you hit 18, college, military, whatever you do, job, whatever you do, 25. You got to prepare yourself because that other generation that's above you, they going to become elderly. They going to become sick. Some of them going to pass. They going to be gone. You ain't going to have that extra layer of protection. And if you ain't became the woman that you supposed to be, you can't look to your left and see your husband. You ain't became the man that you supposed to be fast enough. You can't look to your right, see your wife, have that family structure. That you grew up with. Now you have that family structure for your kid. If you don't have that. And that older generation leave. Right. You're not going to have. The same village. And you are going to stress out. Whoever is left. Because you're not doing. What you're supposed to do. It's called life. At a certain point. You got to do. What the older generation used to do for you. And provide for the youth. So I wanted to make this. Because a lot of people have situations like live when they're younger. Don't get them under control. And become burdens when they get older. And who does this hurt the most? That younger generation. Because you don't do what you're supposed to do for them. Because you're still dealing with stuff that you don't have under control. So I like that. Live found outlets, you know, but it's a lot of people out here that don't find the outlets that they need, don't get this stuff under control with whatever addiction that they have. 
Salute to all American for touching on this. I wanted to expound on it and go deeper on what I got from them showing this on the TV. It's Smack the Guru. I hope y'all enjoyed this deep views. If this your first time here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Click that like button. And like always, man, y'all be easy. Be safe. Peace.